As the healthcare system tackles the coronavirus outbreak, many are seeing a shortage of supplies. News Channel 9's Adrian Smith caught up with a local teacher who's using her free time to help those on the front lines. Sewing has been a longtime hobby for Rachel Witter. But her passion quickly turned into a desire to help others, now needed more than ever in the midst of the coronavirus pandemic. I didn't, I really didn't know that it was such a big need and um, like I'm definitely glad to help. I actually got all this fabric to make um, scrunchies in my like downtime and like I can use all this to, to make masks. And she's been busy, already making close to 100 masks in just three days. She's been reading over the CDC's guidelines, and ironically, she had all the fabrics and supplies ready to sew right in her own home. So what I've been doing is using um, for the inside, it's called um, Snuggle Flam, and it's actually for baby blankets, and it's a really like tight-knit um, cottony fabric for the inside, and then for the outside, just 100% cotton, like I've got on here. This is what I would use to make scrunchies and I just so happen to have a lot of um, that snuggle flannel laying around. The masks are washable and reusable and they come in adult and children's sizes, but they don't look like your typical medical mask. Just funny because I always buy funny fabric is that like there's there's so much happier than your regular surgical. Oh, I hope that like the silly prints that I got um, I think the world just needs like a smile right now. So I hope that like wherever these are, people like, you know, it puts a smile on people's faces in a time that I think we need it the most. She's so right, and she's doing what she loves for a good cause. Witter's masks are making their way around the country for nurses, doctor's offices, and even families. She isn't charging anything for the masks, but she is accepting donations for shipping and supply costs. Nicole? What a great story, Adrian. Thank you. You love to see those acts of kindness, those selfless acts of kindness. If you want to find out how you can get in touch with her, that will be on our website for you. That's localsyr.com.